And I'm really excited to be here with you today at Dennis Franklin Cromartie High School. Like I said, I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do after high school, but I'm not really sure. Well, I talked to my guidance counselor, and he suggested that science isn't just something that happens in a lab in a white coat. He said that science, technology, engineering, and math are happening everywhere. It's all around us. And when we combine these skills, there are some, some amazing possibilities for us to create cool jobs and opportunities for ourselves. Today we, uh, we were doing a Let's Talk Science. We were presenting uh, to students that um, you can be an entrepreneur at a, long, at a young age and you can start your plan you know, after you uh, figure out your schooling and you, know, you figure out what you have to do afterwards. Well, entrepreneurship really is about risk and more important than just taking risk, it's about finding calculated risk. So figuring out, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a leap right now, but how do I make sure that this leap is the least painful it could possibly be if I fall. It's really important to surround yourself with people who believe in you and because it can be hard, you know, all entrepreneurs have some, some sense of fear, so it's really important to have um, support. You know, it's, it's nice to have a plan and, and to set goals, ambitious goals, and to work towards it and, and to, to, in a systematic way, but at the same time, to not be too narrow in your vision. You know, always keep an eye on what's going on on the side. If there's something shiny along your way off to the side, you know, it might be worth checking out. Uh, some of the advice that I gave would be like, you know, you don't have to worry about making your own plan right away. You can just figure it out as you go along. Uh, you can start with something small, um, like, you know, just finding an everyday job. And then you can figure out what you want to do from there. Uh, during the breakout session, uh, we uh, got kids to uh, brainstorm more about um, being an entrepreneur and creating a, uh, problem solving um, techniques and uh, uh, I guess uh, more one-on-one -on -one questions and answers and uh, stuff like that. Hi my name is River Beardy. I'm currently in grade 11. I learned um, what kind of skills you might need to learn a to run a business, how important math and science is in running a business. Well my idea was um, having a wood shop that can have people who come from schooling work there full-time make furniture and stuff. In uh, tech class, we learn about entrepreneurship and, um, and how to start one and be your own boss. And we were just doing an activity about um, problem solving, about like sit, uh, daily problems and how to uh, solve it with uh, basically with science and math. T take defeat with a grain of salt, but you have to keep moving past that because that's the only way you're gonna get through it. Being an entrepreneur, and having skills is like having the courage, first of all, to take the risk and to move into being an entrepreneur. But I think it's also dedication and commitment and perseverance. 